Alright guys, so we're trying out a new camera today that I just got in. This is a little baby swing thingy slash mobile. Uh, uh, that. Most of it works, some of it does not. I've already had this thing apart and troubleshot it. See it powers up and plays music and the mobile works. But when you try to make it swing the baby, nothing. I actually got the motor to work a little bit. Um, but then it quit again. So I've had it apart. I had it on camera, but I deleted the file. So we're going to do it again, and I'll show you what I checked as I go through it. So there's uh, nine screws holding this clamshell on from underneath. Then this top comes up. And let me make sure you guys can see this. So these are all the different leads going to the different functions. And lucky for us, all the heads are color coded with the sockets. So we can just pop these out without worrying too much about it. Now, first time I did this, I did take a picture of it just for safe. So that's our control board. So <clears throat> what I did the first time was I had it powered up and took an actual voltage reading on the board for the motor and it's all well laid out they, they tell you what's what on it and i found voltage there and the voltage did change so i checked that then i checked uh, the motor itself and it was showing good so i ran it through some paces and it worked great for about a minute and then just died off so i'm gonna re-aim this camera at the motor assembly. All right, so this is the motor assembly here, and it's got this spring-loaded arm here that goes through this plastic arm right here that moves with the swing, and that's what that's how the motor rocks the swing back and forth it's from that spring-loaded arm. So we got to get this whole assembly out, and I'm gonna take it to the workbench in there just three screws on this puppy now the fun part is getting this thing out it's got to come out at this really strange angle I think my tripod is actually in the way of me swinging this. So there's this magic angle that you put the uh, basket at and it gives you the room to move this thing. And get it out. So there you have it. The assembly. Sweet. Alright, so off to the uh, GP Woodworks cave. So I have ordered some replacement motors for this thing. I went to Fisher Price's website and all they sell is the entire assembly for like 50 bucks. I'm not dumping 50 bucks into this thing when I can buy it for 100 the whole thing. So I got these. I actually bought two because they were cheap enough. I don't even remember how much they were. I just know they were cheap as hell. So this is the motor that I bought. And so we got to find this part in here and replace it. Let's see how much of this has to come apart. So that part comes off in one piece and behaves. So, 
Got a little worm gear action going. out without tearing nothing up too much. There we go. Okay. Alright, so we have a a diode and a cap here that did not come with the new one. So I'm going to try it without the diode and the cap and see what happens. And if I need to, I will put the diode and the cap on there. Alright, so uh, these batteries I have are actually low drain, so I don't know how long they're going to last. I may be switching back to the other camera. But, hey, that wasn't so bad. I don't think we broke anything either. All right. So we're gonna hang on to this puppy in case we need to move these over. This is the new one. Oh, big. All right, so let's see if we can get this puppy back to where she needs to be. All right. All right, so when you're doing this, don't press on the metal ring. Just press on the worm gear. All right. Here, like such. And we have but it's not closing all the way. Which means, oh, there we go. It's got a registration doohickey like that. And then this thingy goes on that thingy. Alright, so those batteries lasted about three minutes. So, looks like I'm waiting for the power supply for the new camera. I don't know how much of that it saved, but hopefully you saw the first one of these. Alright, so we're going to go put this back in and uh, see if she tries to roll. Alright, so this thing... I don't really have a lot of room to get in here and show you guys the routing of the cables on here. If you got to do this, it won't be that hard to figure out. But just to keep from pinching anything. There's little clips in here specifically for that purpose. Screws. All right, I'm going to get this thing screwed back together and we'll get the camera turned back on after that. All right, guys. It's all put back together. On, we have music, birdies, water, we have mobile, There you go. That is set to whiplash. Alright guys, simple as that. So I will have a uh, part number, in case you guys have one of these, I'll have a part number for that motor in the description of the video. And if I can remember where I bought it from, I'll even give you a link to that. Simple, easy, takes a little bit of time, but can be done. and. That's the fix. 
for that particular problem with this particular gizmo. So, anyway, yeah, thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys next time.